Hey everyone, welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Repentance, where we're going to play as Tainted Eden, therefore there's nothing to discuss. The run is just completely random. Every time we get hit, we re-roll into a different character. Well, a different character, sorry. A different run. So, unless I roll into a run, which means that I take no damage, I'm just permanently invulnerable, we're going to, like, swap. Just accept it. When we get very good runs, we have to do our best and not get hit. So it's a bit like playing... A mixture between The Lost and Tainted Jacob, I guess, because we just don't want to be hit. Fortunately, though, we have done some really awkward shit. Like, we've done Mother, we've done Boss Rush. We've done the Polaroid Pathway, we've done the Negative Pathway. We have to do Mega Satan, The Beast, and then Hush Delirium. To that goal, I don't know what I'm going to aim for first. Alright, there's my first roll. Brilliant health. Don't get killed by that. Walk out. Shot speed down. Wonderful. By the way, in case you're wondering why I'm starting with the other item, we got Eden's Blessing on the last run. Uh, here is my seed I'm about to get hit, I think. Nope. We're good. Uh, why are my tears so scuffed, by the way? <laughs> I have the world's slowest tears. Whatever. But yeah, I have to remember, the one thing I can do is this character... If we get a truly god-awful run, just run into fire or something and end the misery. Uh, that's another Horf. Okay, we could use Horf offensively. We might as well take every single item we get. There's basically no reason not to pick up an item now. Uh, also, I think I'm not... Sorry, I, I didn't finish my sentence at the start. I, I think I'm going to avoid Mega... Sorry, Hush for now. I think Hush is something I'll do on its own run. It probably makes more sense because, you know, we have to do Delirium as well. So it makes sense to do the Hush Path, going to Delirium. Get a Horf. Which, obviously, I can't easily do going to Mega Satan. Like, if Delirium shows up and we're on a god tier run and I'm invulnerable, yes, of course, I'll do Delirium if it shows up after Mega Satan. It can't show up after B, so I think I will go for Mega Satan now. I think that's my aim. So we're not going to take the first devil deal and we're not going to even look at it. I'm not even going to let it taint my judgment. Unless I teleport in there and it's something godly, in which case we'll go for the beast instead. But that is the only way I change my mind. Right, I think this is the secret room. Here. Wonderful. I'll pick you up in a moment. Actually, it doesn't even matter. <laughs> I don't know how the rolling works exactly now. It used to be the rerolls were completely broken. If you have not played Repentance yet, but you're familiar with Afterbirth or Afterbirth Plus. So rerolling like the D4, the D100 were just instant wins. Why? Because you used to reroll into health and you would get the health benefit of it. When you'd reroll, you wouldn't lose it. You would keep it. So it was basically you always had the item. And it eventually led to you breakfasting yourself because once you'd picked up like everything light in the game, all you'd get after that was breakfast. So you could always guarantee yourself health. So basically the, the, the run was won. Because every time you rerolled, you gained health. Even if you had like a... Unless you had a truly awful run and you couldn't get back to another reroll time, you were fine. But now that's not the way it works anymore. Health is actually subtracted from you. When you lose the health up item. Which is very scary and can lead to some very precarious situations. If we re-roll into something like Nine Lives, for example. Where it'll take my health away from me. And when I re-roll, I won't necessarily get it back, I think. Actually, I'm not sure about that. Maybe I'm talking bullshit. Maybe I do get my health back. Maybe that's the one instance where it's good. Well, yeah, I might roll into the body and then lose the body. That's a more apt... Comparison. Uh, thank you for the keys. Honestly, consumables right now, very good. I can't remember if Tainted Eden has any other benefit. And I, I say any other benefit with tongue in cheek because this is not a benefit. Okay, I will take the Book of the Dead. Why do I think that would work? Okay. Waste Book of the Dead, but it doesn't matter. The other thing that's been changed is eventually you would reroll. Sorry, you'd reroll yourself into every transformation in the game. So you'd get shit like Fungi, you would get Guppy, and so on and so forth. 
Now, I think you have to have all items on you to get the transformation. So, it's very, very unlikely that that's going to happen now. Also, remember, your consumables will re-roll as well. So, my card is now re-rolled into Justice. justice. Ah, fuck it, sure. Dealing self-damage to myself via something that I'd have to donate, you know, health to, doesn't trigger the Eden roll. I think it used to be the curse room would activate it, but they changed that, so it doesn't anymore. But that's still not fantastic, in all honesty. So, again, the only thing we can do is try and maximize the items we get. Then, look for anything that can maybe stay between, like, transformations. Like, my little micro-me, that lift, like, even though I re-rolled out the item. Oh, we have gold membership right now. Hang on a minute. Hang on a moment. Please no one hit me. I want to have a look at something. Yeah, just come over here. Listen up. There's another one. There you are. There you are. Come here. Wonderful. Uh, I'm not taking this just yet in case it's Bad Trip, because I think Bad Trip will re-roll me. I will peep the shop, because I want to know what the gold membership area holds for me. Hello, Trinket Smelter. I do love you. Now, here's a question. If you smell a trinket to yourself, does the trinket get re-rolled? 15 gold pennies is what you're asking for. So I need at least 30 gold pennies to do what I'm kind of planning to do. I really don't pick Trinket Smelter up is the thing. Unless I can guarantee that I smelt. What I think I'm going to do is... Just be smart about this. Grab you. Can you drop into a penny, please? Oh... I would take Brainworm. I think it'll re-roll. I, I think the Trinket re-rolls too. I'm 90% certain it does. Okay, that's what we wanted. A little bit of extra change. Let's let's just see. Humor me. I'm fairly certain it's legitimately everything re-rolls. And if I can get 50 more cents, sure, I'll pick up Trinket Smelter before we leave and maybe smelt a Trinket to myself as well. Although there are some truly awful Trinkets. So we have to be a little bit careful of that. Uh, hello. Just focus. Would I smelt the hand, the left hand to myself? No, that seems dumb. Honestly, Bob's front head, better than what I've got right now. So we have the curse room and the boss fight. Okay, perfect. Bob's rotten head straight on the boss. That's going to do some mega damage to him. Maybe makes me reroll by accident. There you go. Bob's rotten head, ladies and gentlemen. We don't want this, so just don't look at it. Pretend it's not there. Pretend it's an illusion. Hello, Millie. We're not going to be able to make the money happen, unfortunately. So I... F oh, let's peep the curse room. I'll give it every single chance. All right, we benefited from... No, actually, we, we broke even from going in there. Oh, I do have piggy bank right now, so... If I can hurt myself intentionally in a way that is a donation of health, I can make all the money back. I knew you'd be health down. So I'm pretty certain now that health is gone forever. Well, I say it's gone forever. I don't think that will re-roll because it wasn't associated with an item. So I think all my re-rolls from now will give me two red hearts. Or less, depending on what I re-roll into. Or more, depending on what I re-roll into. But I can only think of one thing that takes health off you right now. Uh, we will not go in the curse room just yet. I'd love to get to my shop again. Before getting hit, of course. Okay, goodbye. Okay, goodbye. Uh, I've re-rolled into a lot of health here. That's because I've got two health up items. Yeah, I'm right. So two health is my base health. So actually health up pills would be really good. 
Uh, I have remote detonator. I have a sharp plug, that's really annoying. But as I said, the transformations, they don't linger anymore, so we're not one third of the way to Bookworm anymore. We're, well, no thirds. I think. I'm pretty certain this is how it works. I, I could be misremembering. I've not played this character for a while. All I remember is he just tilts me because I, I like to plan my runs and go like, you know what, if this shows up, I'd be really happy. But you can't really do it as this character because as long as you grab an item, you're good. That's, that's all you want to do, grab items. Oh, your, your trinket does re-roll, by the way. I've lost brain worm. All right. So I'm pretty certain if I smell a trinket to myself, it will re-roll. Understood. So then it leads me to a situation where I, I basically should really think of stories to tell. And boy, do I have a story to tell. Of, well, I have two, actually. One is the reason why my schedule might be scuffed for the next few days. So I'm recording this on the Sunday. Sunday... Is it the 6th? I, I don't remember what date it is exactly. But it was a day ago, basically. And I woke up in the morning, I'd been up late, I'd watched some of the Owls, I'd been watching the Overwatch League again. And what do I think of 5 of 5? Pretty good. But that's not the story. So I was up till maybe 1 in the morning or something, doing uh, some reading and watching the, the Owls. Oh, wait, this is going to hurt me. Alright, just stay there, bomb. And I wake up in the morning, and so the internet's fine. I wake up at... 5 a.m. because that's when the cats wanted me to wake up. And lo and behold, my internet's not on anymore. And I'm like, okay. Whenever like everything loses its connection, just restart the router. It's almost always that. Like there's been a little fault in the night. Like, and you know, it'll be fine. I restart the router, no, it doesn't do anything. I unplug every cable it asks me, because I don't own Sky, so I was going through Sky's help thing. It's like, oh, make sure. The internet's plugged into the wall. It's like, you know, yeah, no shit, Sky. I know it's plugged into the wall. Make sure the power cable's connected. It's like, yeah, I can see the fucking three lights I just told you in the previous step. I did all their things, and by like 10 in the morning, I was like, right, I, I can't fix this. I have to call them up. But the annoying thing is, my roommate is the account holder, not me. So that's a real pain in the ass. So immediately call Sky up, and they're like, eh. Sorry, your phone number is not the account holder. Can you, like, provide the phone number of the account holder? It's like, well, she's not here. She's out at the moment. Yes, I know she's got a broken leg still. But she's out seeing her friends. And I'm like, oh, my God. It's like, I need the internet. Like, the Elden Ring video. It's not going to upload in time anymore. Which it, it did, but it's not going to get the high-definition version. So apologies if you watched it on Sunday in, like, 360p. Blame Sky. I ring them up and I'm like, okay, I'm not the account holder, but the internet is just fucked. And they're like, oh, let us check it from our end. And I was like, yeah, please. And they're like, hmm, from our end, it looks fine. It's like, we'll send an engineer around somewhere between one and six. And I'm like, no, for God's sake. It's like, fine. I'll just have to accept it. But this also now means, because I normally record maybe like at least four videos on a Sunday. Sometimes I'll do like six or seven because then I can rest in the week. On occasions. I normally have a little rest day on Monday. Which I'm not going to get this time. But I couldn't record the videos because I have to now wait around for Sky to come. Because at this point when I've got through the phone call and through all the awful automated stuff. Oh fuck. I've still got this stupid spacebar item. Yeah, by the time all that happened it was 11. So I was like, okay, if this guy shows up at 12, I know he said 1. I'm going to be like caught out here. So I sit around, I use up all the data on my phone basically to just try and entertain myself because we can't use the TV anymore basically because that's hooked up to the internet. We mainly just use you know, Netflix and stuff. Like, I don't even have the, the, net, the normal TV scanned anymore. It's not even got an aerial in it because literally we just use you know online internet now. Oh fuck's sake, this item! So eventually we get to 1 p.m. where I'm waiting for this engineer and lo and behold about half one the internet just turns back on again and I'm like are you fucking kidding me? Oh the item. Like I've waited all this time. Like I, I spent hours in the morning basically from 5 a.m. till 11 trying to 
Nope. Sort this out. And you'd flick back on, literally, that's going to scare the shit out of me if I walk past. I flick it on again at basically 12 hours after the fact. And it's fine. I say switch it back on. It just turned itself back on. I didn't do anything. I was just sat on the sofa. Like, one minute I saw it was like green, orange, green, which means the internet's down, the wireless is up, and the. What's the other thing? The power is on. And I'm like, oh my god. It's like, let me call Sky again. Go through that awful automated system. Because I don't want the engineer to come anymore. So I call them up and she's like, oh, are you the account holder? And I'm like, no, I'm not. Does this re-roll your run? Uh, or is it a, it's a random dice, right? Soul of Isaac. Uh, turns all pedestal items in the current room into rotating items. Okay, it does not do what I thought it did. What did I see on this floor? Toxic shock. I picked up wood in a box. So I have no items right now. Understood. Oh, I think I was on an XL floor. In the ramble. But yeah, so I'm talking to him like, oh, are you the account holder? I'm like, no, I'm not. But like, I booked it without being the account holder. So like, is it an issue? And she's like, oh yeah, well, I can't access the account to cancel the booking. Unless you're the account holder. So like, can you get her on the phone? And I'm like, well, she's not here at the moment. And they're like, oh, well, that's really inconvenient for you. And I was like, well, yeah, it is. No shit it is. And she's like, okay, what is your landline number? And I'm like, I have no fucking idea what our landline number is. Why? Because we don't use it at all. We just use mobiles now. It is the year 2022. That's right, right? It's the year 2022. I don't know anyone that uses the landline anymore. And that's where we were. So I'm just sat there. I should have really left this on the floor. I'm just sat there going like, oh, what the fuck am I going to do about all this? Like, they can't cancel it. I'm just going to have to sit there and wait for this engineer because I can't put my headphones on and, like, record. Because I won't hear the door and no one else is here other than the cats who will just hide. They won't tell me, go, father, the, the, the guy's here. So I wait there till 6pm and now it's, like, 7pm. The fucking engineer didn't come. After providing all the details, I, I found the land line eventually so that we could access the account. I logged into her account as myself, and despite all this information I provided for them, they were like, yeah, we can't cancel it. So, like, he's probably going to call when he comes, so just, like, tell him when, like, he comes that, you know, it's all good. Everything's bueno now. And I'm like, are you, like, <clears throat> so I've waited here all day, and what the fuck is this? Oh, I've got anti-grav tech. Okay, this is fun. I re rolled into a health down pill as well. Ah, all my bombs will go off now. But yeah, I've waited all day and he's just not come. Okay, by the way, get ready for this. Now that is gaming. Let me go and pick up the red heart before I die. Again, in case you didn't know, if you have a health down pill and you're on one health, it becomes a health up pill. Very useful. I've now got a tier 3 little friend. And I'm not entirely sure if they will persist between the rerolls. Because they're not on my item thing right now. Eh, yeah, sure. Let's move. Strength's pretty good. Where was the other bomb I left? Oh, it's here. <laughs> Fuck me. Nearly killed myself. But yeah, the moral of the story is that during the day where I would have recorded it, I've not been able to record for the reason that I was waiting for a Sky Engineer, despite the fact that my internet is now working. This is unbelievably stupid. Yeah, don't do it. I was considering playing it with strength, but I think that would have led to shenanigans. Uh, you're actually just a bomb. Your coins, I remember you. I'm sure I left one more bomb. 
By the way, this might be one of the coolest, like, character, like, looks I've ever seen. What's giving me the funny helmet? Is it Thunder Thighs? Hmm. I might as well play Judgment. And by play Judgment, I might as well use Judgment and see if I get an Angel Beggar. Judge. I did. I will play you. Because I would love a health up right now. Do not give me a troll bomb. Because I cannot save you. Just letting you know. I was worried for a second. I saw the black thing come out of you. He, he's trying my patience. He's trying to troll me. If I lose this eternal heart because you produce a troll bomb, I'm going to be upset. Also, I would like you to pay out. That'd be fantastic. Thank you. Couldn't ask for anything more. Alright, let's leave the floor. So the Eternal Heart will persist now between things because it's not an item. The health up though will be lost, so I am aware that will occur to me in the future. Also, I've got a funny feeling this trinket is actually giga garbage, but I don't remember why. <laughs> it's pop cap, right? Cap. No, it's not pop cap. No, it is. It's called ring cap, sorry. I dropped two bombs at once. Oh. Oh, that's not that bad. Also, this run is not that bad. This would be a really good run for boss rush. And I say really good, it'd be suitable. Yes, I forgot thunder fires. I can break rocks now. All right, be careful of bomb rocks. Nope. The other story I have is last night I was ordering food and I've had like a pretty tiring day. I recorded a lot yesterday, which is pretty fortunate after what happened today. And I'm like, okay, it's 7 p.m. The Owl Games start at 8 p.m. This is BST. And I, I can't be bothered cooking. I'm like, I'm going to order some food. I've literally recorded from like 9 in the morning or something and basically didn't stop. I ordered myself a Subway sandwich, delicious, with some nacho chicken bites. They're not fantastic, but you know, they're, they're going to fill you up. And I put through the order, and it says on it, like, oh, you have an age-inappropriate item. And i like, hmm, that seems stupid. And I have ordered this before, and it's been on there. And basically, they've come here and said, like, there's an age thing on this. And they're like, that's stupid. And they just give me my order. And I'm like, thank you. Thank you, kind sir, for delivering me my food. The guy that came last night was like... Oh, apparently you've got, like, an age-restricted thing on there. And I'm like, oh, yeah, here's my date of birth, just in case you're interested. And it's like, no, I need, f like, formal ID. And I'm like, what? It's like, I want formal ID. It's like, you are aware you just brought me... Fuck. Fuck! Oh, my God. You, you are aware you just brought me a Subway sandwich? How have I got one heart now? Health up, please. That's not a health up item. How have I got this item again? God damn it. Well, at least while the going's good, let's use the bombs. So like, you've just brought me a sandwich from Subway. Like, what are you talking about? Like, I've got an age-restricted item. And it's like, oh, do you know what it is? I'm like, no! Is it the, like, I presume it's the nachos? It's like, is it my meatball sub? they put something special in the sauce that I don't know about? And it's like, oh, like, I'm sorry. Like, do you have a driving license? No, I don't have a driving license. I, I don't drive. I used to be... Very fond of drinking on weekends, and I decided not to make a habit of drink driving, so I just chose to just not drive full stop. And my passport's expired, but I couldn't find it anyway, the expired passport. I know roughly where it is, but it's going to be shuffled around when the great leg breaking happened. And I was like, I I'm sorry, I don't know where it is. And he was like, well, basically, fuck you then. It's like, goodbye. Oh... Oh. I'm like, just give me my fucking sandwich. I just want a sandwich. Oh my god, paralysis. Uh, what have we got now? We have chili pepper. I need to get into the shop. And he's like, oh, I, I, I could lose my job over this. I got it a subway. <laughs> just give me my food. So he calls someone up and I'm saying like, listen, call your superior and tell them that you've ordered from Subway. And there's an age-restricted item on it. And ask them what to do. And I presume, again, 
The smart thing here is that they're just going to say, oh yeah, this is just a bug in the system. Give the man his sandwich and his chicken. And he calls them up and he goes, oh, okay, like, well, the nachos were age restricted for some reason from Subway and uh, I can't give you them, but I'll, I'll, I'll give you the sandwich. We'll compromise and give you the sandwich. Compromise? Like, it's my sandwich and I paid for it. Give me my fucking sandwich. And yeah, long story short, I didn't get my nachos. I got my sandwich, but not my nachos. And then I called up delivery and I was like, listen, you fucking punks. It's 7 p.m. on a Saturday. I've had a long day of work. And you've denied me of my sandwich and chicken. I've only got my sandwich. I'm like, oh, sorry for your, like, experience with us. We will refund it with credit. We could also refund you with actual money, but... Uh, it will take longer. And I was like, oh, just give me fucking credit then. But man... I just wanted to snack after that. Anyway, that was... My Saturday night, I watched Owl angrily after being denied some chicken. And the thing is, it's not even great, but for some reason, when I was thinking about it, I was like, oh man, I could really do with those nacho chicken bites now. Like, they're subpar, tasteless white filth at best. I basically just get them to bulk out my stomach. Oh, by the way, the little, uh, I was going to say the little red boy, he stays with us. So actually, Potato Peeler was a wonderful get. Fuck. I'm not using two bombs to make a shortcut. Not in this economy. Anyway, where are we on the run? Uh, oh yeah, I forgot. Doesn't matter. Although we do have a nice synergy, actually. We have car battery sprinklers, so we'll, go, we'll pop that on the boss. It'll give me two sprinklers. We'll do some decent damage. I also re-rolled into Red Stew, which is very annoying because you don't get the damage up from it, I think. So it's basically just a nothing item. Get sprinkled. Ooh! Okay, we're re-rolling. Oh, I lose the sprinkler! Are you kidding me? Okay, he's gone. All right. Excellent. Yeah, that's really good. I was hoping that'd be health up. Ooh! Nearly died. Get them, little little red boy. Why have I still got the Taratoma? Did I re-roll into it? Oh, have I got Sack Dagger? Oh, we, we have Regen? I don't know. Oh, we lost the Devil Deal during that. That's pretty annoying. Uh, I will bomb this Gold Rock because I think money will be more valuable than the bomb right now. And let's go down. At what point do I make a pivot if I've not got an angel deal yet? I'm not sure. Oh, we have lots of money now. We have Dreamcatcher. So I'm getting half a spirit heart every floor. And spin. Spin! In theory, this looks like quite fun, but I think it's going to hurt me immediately. Right. I guess it's this floor, so we should hold the fool card. Which actually, now that I think about it, is really fucking annoying to do. Because if I get hit, I reroll. Alright. You know what? The Not the path I was taking anyway. This is spin down dice, right? This is a reroll of an item, but it rerolls down one. Which is pretty good, honestly. I've got two curse rooms. I had the item that gave me two curse rooms. Understood. Would it be a secret room between them by any chance? Please. God damn it. <laughs> it was too good to be true. It was too good to be true. I'm not even sure it can spawn anyway. I just want to use my items, but then you take it away, when I misplay a bit, you take my items away, bam 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 boo boo doo boo 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 boo. 
Okay, we have the thing that if we break rocks, you get spiders. Hello again, piggy bank. We have seen you before. Honestly, I should have re-rolled you. Uh, we will re-roll Shoop the Whoop if it comes up. If you think I know what Shoop the Whoop re-rolls into of the the table of the items, you have another thing for me. Like, I barely know what the items do, let alone, like, what order they appear in the game's config files or whatever it pulls from. No. We'll peep the shop. Please don't greed. Uh, glowing hourglass is fucking useless for me right now. Okay, you could be interesting. I will take you. We may never use the spin down dice. I don't know why I'm looking at the items going like, oh, that could be interesting for me in the late the, fu the future. I'm going to get hit eventually. Like, the run's not good enough to win as is. I'm not invulnerable. Ooh, the gold bombs, though, they will persist for a reroll, I think. I hope. They persist, right? Ooh, you piece. You know what? We have gold bombs. Let's knock ourselves out a little bit. In fact, I should break every single rock right now. That's what I should be doing. Casper, you're scaring me. Get him. There's a ghost left. I break the schools. All right, I would have liked that a little bit earlier, but sure. Sorry, I, I just thinking gold bombs, spider rock. Pretty good combo, Wombo. Oh, I forgot I haven't been in this room yet. There's a pin. Okay. Those rocks should give me twice as much money. I don't know if they did. Oh no, they give me flies. I'm done. What are we talking about money for? Twice as many spiders. Uh, you know what? Get killed. I nearly said, where the hell's my... Uh, what car did I have before? Chariot. I nearly said, where's my chariot gone? Like, where do you think your chariot's gone, genius? Like, have you seen what character you're playing, guys? Was there any rocks in here? Was there any rocks? Were there any rocks? Listen, getting tilted, reminding yourself about the subway story is no reason to use bad grammar. Oh, you get it from mushrooms too. Nice. Uh, Hermit, I will hold. Later. You're not a rock, though. Oh, you did pay out, though. Right, well, see what's in here. Alright. Use two of diamonds, because I'm lazy. Grab the hermit. Grab this and turn it out. Thank you. Destroy that. Wonderful. So we have a hundred percent angel chance. We have decent amount of spirit arts protecting me, but who knows what happens when I get hit? I do have two curse rooms that we might want to visit at some point. Hmm, not a secret room. Okay. I haven't got my fool card, so we can't do the beast anymore. I've just got rid of my other teleport card. Like a genius. That literally isn't an option. So we are lit. We're literally only now in it for one thing. Possibly two. If everything goes wrong, we might still get Delirium Portal. In which case, we'll just go for Delirium. Which will make the Hush one a little bit easier to do. Because then I can just go do Hush. In fact, I could do Hush Mega Satan. It'd be hard, but we could do it. Uh, where's the other secret room at? I have infinite bombs, so I feel like I should find it. 
You there? You here? Yes. Hello. Right, this is speed up. Speed. Wonderful, it's a permanent stat. Right. You have gold bombs. This shouldn't be a problem, right? Don't get hit against Mother. You have a, a ton of spiders as well. I heard that. Okay, it's Blue Mum who doesn't stomp a lot. No! I wanted to reroll my items. Uh, where do we want to go? Probably on the... Well, the negative is almost certainly better. It won't reroll. I've got Ipecac. But then I have to go down on the negative pathway. I'd rather go through the Polaroid pathway and get four free items. Okay. Immaculate Heart is fairly good. Double Angel Statue as well. Very bueno! What the fuck have I got? I've got... Okay, he's gone. I had Tiny Planet, didn't I? <laughs> I couldn't aim my tears at all. Well, there's the key piece. So we are on course for Mega Satan. Uh, what have we got now? Parasitoids. Gimpy. We can throw our head around. It's gone. But my head retain remains. It's on the floor. I have soy milk. Or almond milk. Uh, <laughs> and we have the D20. Wonderful. And I have to keep a sack, which is useless. That, though, is very good. Oh, there's a Tinted Drop. Or something. We have tech. There's something here. Why did my fly go to it? Not fly. Why did my little fairy boy go to it? What? I'm confused. He definitely went there, right? Hmm, part of it. Oh, we have Burnt Penny now. As a trinket. We have Tech X. Which is not as good as it used to be, but it's still pretty good. Uh, the Scissor Things, or whatever they're called, the, the Shear Things. Pretty good as well. What's my major source of concern right now? My health. That nearly hit me. The curse room doesn't offer me anything. Pins. I think. Nope, someone tried to telefrag me. You know what? You die. Wonderful. Good use of two charge. Uh, that was my soul dying. Don't worry about it. It's okay. <laughs> the stars and Perthro. Oh, we'll hold both of them. Why did you explode? Slightly confused why you exploded. Where am I going as well? This way? Nope. Down. Right. Goodbye. Goodbye. Ace of spades. I don't even know what's here anymore. Where did my ace of spades things go? <laughs> I guess it got re-rolled. And we now have how to jump. I have red heart health. And the stars card. And we look like we're the lost. Why am I the lost? Okay, it's gone. I I have Ludo. What the fuck is wrong with my run? Hang on a minute. I can't express to you what's going on. I can't make my tears go left. I've got tiny bloody Ludo! This is so horrible! I'll push this though. Oh, come on. Honestly, we should leave this health down on the floor. The speed of I shall take. And your question mark's wonderful. Because if I go to one heart, that health down will be a health up. 
Oh my god. What does this do? What? I, I'm so confused right now. I, I feel like I have no health anymore. I have anti-grab again. And there's just a tear stuck there. And I'm just getting hit by everything. But I have Mum's Knife now. That's the most important thing. Oh! No, 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 no! Ah! Protect yourself. Holy shit. Where's the... Oh my god. The game is trolling me. Was this the room I left the health up pill in? Thank you, Lord. Health up. Right, what is this thing I've got? Hang on a minute. <laughs> Wait. Do I flip between two characters? Is this what's going on here? Have I just got two characters now that re-roll? How is this run so gigabad? I have 0.83 damage and I don't have a good rate of fire. Yeah, give me this guy with mum's knife. Yeah, 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 we'll play as this character. This one's good. Health? Not health? Alright. This one is kind of scary. <laughs> no, my cube of meat's on the other character! I've now got a cube of meat on this one! Oh god. I should have flipped so I could get Cuba Meat level 4 on the other character. I, I just can't get rid of Jake Winnie's out. The game just wants me to play as him. Even when I'm playing as Tainted Eden, I've somehow ended up as him. Tears up. Tears up. Would have been much better on the other character. But hey ho. Uh, yes, we're going to stay as this character so you gain some health, you piece. Alright, this is still pretty good. It looks bad, but it's not. Alright, that's less good. But if we get to be the other character, which I could easily do. Hang on a minute. I, I've, I've, ooh, boy, I've, I've had a thought. Flip. Become this character. Pick up the heart. We'll do the rest of this floor with the gold bombs. Mainly. Okay, we have attractor bombs as well, just as an FYI. Why do I want to do it as this character? I want this one to re-roll. And I want to flip back into the other one for boss fights, because they're actually good. One for rooms, one for bosses. I think that is the new play. Ooh, it was coming for me. Yeah, I'll do this. Thank you. I would like to try and protect this potential deal. If I get a deal, I'm taking it. Oh, we have poop printed too. Get the fuck away from me. Nice. Thank you, thank you. Didn't matter. We've already done it, that's why. Like, how are you so bad to cube me level 3? And why is this run kind of really good? 
Like, I freeze them in place and I just bomb them. Like that. It's st strangely okay. Now that I shouldn't have done. There's another one coming. I think that's it for hands. Just spend six years of your life shooting down the tentacles. I was hoping to record two episodes before 8pm. Not going to happen. Okay, this is going to be slightly awkward to kill him. Okay, we re-rolled. It's fine, we re-rolled into something worse. But I still have my gold bombs. Do we have a bomb synergy with it? Oh yeah, we do. We have gold bombs? What have we got? Hemolacrima. I have the my favourite thing, but there's no shops left. Stigmata. Hmm. I don't know why my bomb looks slightly gold. Oh, it's... I'm dumb, it's because I've got gold bombs. <laughs> That's why. Yeah. Uh, you know what? If I trusted you at all, maybe. I legitimately don't think you've ever paid out for me. Okay. I have to decide what I'm going to do with the devil now. Am I going to play and swap? I'm going to do one more room. Please kill them all. Wonderful bomb. Wonderful, wonderful bomb. Holy shit. Leave them on the floor. Your job now is to be a sponge. I need to give them names. This guy is Sponge Boy. Sponge Boy sucks up red hearts. And gains bone hearts upon taking damage? What? Are you kidding me? Well. Well, that's just the way the cookie crumbles. I could do more rooms, but that seems stupid. Oh, I haven't got the item to flip anymore! I'm dumb! I took damage! <laughs> Okay, you are the one and only sponge and I love you. Has anyone ever told you that? Eh, uh, this seems good. Oh, no, 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 no. Mum is stomping on me. I think. I don't know what's going on. I have something shooting the f Oh, I've got bot fly or turret fly, whatever it's called. Turret fly? This has to be soy milk again, right? Uh, let me just have a peek. What's my health situation? Grim. <sighs> I think we just go up. I have 0.84 damage still. Wonderful. I do have mapping though. I think it's up. Again, sorry for people with ears. This run might get noisy. Okay, never mind. We're good. Uh, we can't go in there because we could potentially die. How many bombs do we have left? <laughs> oh my god, I've got my little fucking dog boy. Are you killing him? And by you, I mean my little red boy. Honestly, probably... This is wonderful. I've got an immortality item. I don't regret this at all. Why have I just been given a ton of shit? You know what? Knock yourself out. Full health? Take it. Full health. I've got a really good trinket as well. This is it. This is the run. 
We, this is the run we cherish. It's gone. But, but, okay, I didn't sumo you. I missed. So I've got the sumo item now. Uh, PhD, so pills are good. We have tough love or something like that. Definitely not going to hit by an enemy here, am I? Suplexing them. Thank you. Okay, we were right. You know what? Don't worry about the suplex right now. Now worry about the suplex. Suplex him on his hand. Wonderful. I nearly got stomped by the other one. Remember as well, my little red buddy will deal with everything. He will take care of the rest. I just need to live. Eventually he'll kill Mega Satan for me. Guess you plexed. Okay. I disagree. But sure. I was definitely on the left side of Isaac when I went out of that animation. And then suddenly he just teleported to the other side. Almond milk. Hello. Uh, do I have any good stuff? I have the blanket, but I don't know if that's going to work right now. Can you stop doing that? Thank you. Honestly, purgatory might be my best source of damage right now. Honestly, this character is just purgatory, right? I've got Isaac's heart as well, I've noticed. Well, there, there it goes. Sci-Fly! Sci-Fly wins runs! Sci-Fly wins runs. Okay, we need a miracle. <laughs> we do have Tech X. I am on one health, but we have Sci-Fly and a shield. Potentially there's something here, but I feel like I need help. Goodbye. <laughs> I forgot I couldn't fly again. I was in creep. Oh well, well, that's a tainted Eden for you. Very fun. Never had control of my own destiny. Just wildly going out of control. Anyway, if you enjoyed this episode, don't leave a like, subscribe, everything helps me out, and I'll see you on the next run. Goodbye. <laughs>